Here we have the absolute value in equality, 2 times the absolute value of s minus 4 is greater than or equal to 3. So we're going to get the absolute value term by itself by dividing both sides by 2. This results in the absolute value of s minus 4 is greater than or equal to 3 halves. Now that we have it by itself, we can rewrite our inequality as s minus 4 is less than or equal to negative 3 halves, or s minus 4 is greater than or equal to positive 3 halves. Starting on the left-hand side of the new inequality, we're going to add 4 to both sides. This gives s is less than or equal to 5 halves. Or, going back to the right-hand side, we're going to add 4 as well to both sides, and this results in s is greater than or equal to 11 halves. Looking at our number line, we have a closed circle from 5 halves to negative infinity, and a closed circle from 11 halves to positive infinity. In interval notation, this looks like an open bracket from negative infinity to 5 halves with a closed bracket, in union with an open bracket from 11 halves to infinity with a closed bracket.